Prime Minister O'Neill announced two weeks ago the government's plan to lift the ban on foreign doctors and nurses. That is why we are now lifting up the ban so we allow uh, the Department of Health and Department of Education to go out and bring people in to meet that gap while we train and rebuild capacity. Yesterday, Chief Emergency Physician Dr. Sam Yokopua said he liked the idea given the shortage of skilled health workers in the public service. He said if we don't have, we should look elsewhere. We have our hospital has advertised for seasons and I think they just got less than 10 applicants of 300 or so. And that clearly showed that where else can you get? So if, if you can, cannot get, then you need to look elsewhere, and that's the most appropriate thing. But as long as they've got you know, necessary papers and the registration process are done by uh, those uh, regulatory bodies like the nursing council and the medical board, we'll be happy to work. He said the hospital is in the process of attaining the skills of three foreign nurses. They will join the emergency department once all requirements are met. Meanwhile, the Prime Minister responded to questions on whether the government was going to review remunerations of health workers in PNG. Uh, we all have to realize that we have huge challenges all around the country. Not only in the health sector, let me say, not only upgrading the hospitals and re-equipping them. We need to look after the training of nurses, training of doctors, we need to look after the housing and welfare and salary of doctors. That cannot be done overnight. Absolutely. It will be done over the next five years. So I want all the stakeholders, including uh, all the health workers throughout the country, let us be patient. Let's do one thing at a time first. The Department of Personal Management will recommend to the government what actions and conditions they can afford. They will try to improve workers' conditions, not just in the health sector, but others such as education. Cedric Pajole. National MTV News.